a straight edge straight, razor. Yeah, there is no guard on it. Oh man, this is pretty cool. Never seen it before. <laughs> so I comb it this way and I cut it this way. Mm -hmm. So when I push it this way, it falls. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. As you saw uh, in all of my videos that, you know, we went to Connecticut to get a haircut. So this video is gonna be about uh, the haircut video. The MC Barber doing a haircut. So it's not gonna be a regular vlog or car related or any, any kind of video. So yeah, it's gonna be a little bit different. Just bear with it. The next video is gonna be back to normal. And this is going to be a haircut video. Hi, my name is Mirhan Sajain. I'm otherwise known as MC Barber. Uh, I was uh, three times uh, Connecticut Barber Expo Champion and last year I was number two in the world. So this is how Shai looks before the cut. And we'll see how it looks after the cut. And we've got the brother over here, the pro, Mr. MC. I do this as a traditional haircut. Uh, something that I did uh, for the world competition in September mm -hmm. in Paris last September. Similar haircut that placed number two in the world. I use uh, scissors. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, <laughs> just getting the hair a little bit shorter, it's gonna be the same style. <laughs> this is going to be um, Definitely shorter, mm -hmm. similar style, but with a touch of 2019. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know, we came all the way from Brooklyn, New York. <laughs> You're welcome to my shop in Connecticut. So he has a, a very coarse hair, thick hair. Mm -hmm. That's why I'm cutting it the way I'm cutting it. So I'm kind of thinning it and cutting it at the same time. I did have a I did the same thing with a razor last time when I cut his hair with a razor. So basically this is similar thing. This leaves the hair like a feather. Uh, okay, so just thinning it out. Well, I am thinning it and removing the length as well. The child is getting the VIP hair haircut today. <laughs> you guys are in Brooklyn, huh? Yeah. I felt bad he was here last time because I was the whole night in emergency. You were? And then his appointment was what, like 1 o'clock or yeah. something? So I checked in the previous night in emergency. I, I, I was dehydrated. Wow. And I checked in like 10 o'clock at night and I got out 8 o'clock in the morning. And, and then he came, came to work at 12 o'clock. Uh, my wife was like, are you crazy going to go to work? And then this guy was on my book. I was like, man, I'm glad I came to work. Yeah, that's some commitment. Bad. So what number are you using now? Uh, we are using number six. Number six. I'm gonna go shorter. I'm gonna taper this. This hairline goes up and down, as you can see. Mm -hmm. See how it goes up and then goes down. Down. So uh, I'm gonna make this nice classic look with nice taper here. Uh -huh. A little closer around the ears. Is your YouTube channel mostly on haircuts or different things? Oh uh, no, it's not it's like it's mostly vlogs and like car related videos. So this is gonna be like first haircut video. <laughs> you know he told me yesterday he was coming and then I checked out your channel. I was like, you know, it's cool, so let me go see how the brother does. Yeah, so this is where he's using the C uh razor. Right? Straight edge. Straight. It's a straight edge straight razor. Yeah, there is no guard on it. Oh man, this is pretty cool. Never seen it before. <laughs> then you must not have ever been to an Italian barber. Probably not, yeah. <laughs> uh, this is like Italian specialty? Yeah, Italian barbers really use this. I learned it from Italian. So actually all my uh, 
like techniques I almost learned from Italian barbers. He was razor, you get a more texture. Once you get that, you get the same. So I comb it this way and I cut it this way. Mm -hmm. So when I push it this way, it falls in. Ah, beautiful. I can eat with a man. Uh, I'm Okay. That's just a special scissor? Yeah, so he has a thick hair. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna kind of keep his length, but just remove some length. I mean, some bulk. Okay. Try it, you're lucky how you got that much hair. <laughs> I think I'm losing some hair in the middle. You are? Doesn't look like. They have thick hair though, like yeah. um, meaning that the hair itself is coarse, like the, the, the hair shaft is thick. So I'm not getting too close, so mm -hmm. I'm not uh, thinning his hair. The ends are getting finer, so when he styles it will hold up. I'll show you in a minute. So if you look, you see how the ends are? Mm -hmm. So wash. Oh, you're cracking your knees now. See. Versus a blunt, heavy, you know, right. hair. So this will actually kind of hold the, hold the style. It won't weigh it down. So this uh, haircut, how many ways I can style my hair? Like different ways, right? You can style it like to the side if you want, you can push it straight back. Mm -hmm. This is slightly disconnected, you see? Yeah. Oh, this hair reaches all the way down. But if you push it this way, it blends nice, it doesn't tell, it doesn't show it. But there is a huge disconnect here. Put a, a blunt cut now on top of this, so I'm just gonna use a similar scissors, but they cut a little bit more than the other ones. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna start from here and I wanna... I am gonna do the same thing on this side. <laughs> now I gotta cut this side too, just like this, but I'm gonna switch my hand and use the left hand oh, this so my fingers can point down and I can have a even cut here. kind of like growing out, so you gotta be careful. If you cut it too short, uh -huh. it'll be worse. So we're gonna just sculpt a little bit. Back to razor again. Yes.
So your hair is kind of wavy here mm -hmm. as well. So to blow dry heat here, you gotta be careful because you gotta use a high heat, but using high heat, the client can feel it. So you gotta, you gotta be quick and also make sure the heat doesn't point straight in his scalp, because it points away from the scalp. Okay. And when you blow dry here, I'm not sure who watches your channel, but my my channel is usually it's most educational. I, you know, it's not very entertaining, but it's educational for people that you know are looking to learn. That's what my channel is. I talk about all these things that you have to set the roots for a style to hold. Mm -hmm. If you're, if the roots are not set, then no matter how you blow dry the top. It's not gonna hold. So there is a lot of haircuts out there. I think the best way to finish this haircut something different for people uh, on the YouTube. I think the best way is to really create that Elvis Presley look. So I set his roots here with a medium heat. Mm -hmm. But now I'm gonna convert my heat to high heat. Because I don't have to uh, put my heat on his scalp anymore. So now it's mostly. Now let's polish. I'm oh, sorry. Let's polish his hair. So let's put some oil. So it will make a shine. What kind of oil is that? This is a shine oil. Okay. Put it down for me. I All that blow, blow dry and all that, it's not gonna go away right away if it doesn't. Oh, you know, it, this is not a Brazilian blow dry. In <laughs> <laughs> uh, the Brazilian, that's when they use the chemicals. This is just a, the hair will go back to its natural uh, state once you blow dry it. Mm -hmm. So this will not stay. Uh, Chad is ready to do an Indian movie now. You got to see it already. <laughs> Those guys actually don't have that great haircut. So. <laughs> this is a classic pompadour. I mean, honestly, this is a very nice uh, Elvis look. I mean, if you uh, if you can. 2019 Elvis. <laughs> you guys saw before. Now this is how it looks like now. Elvis <laughs> Presley. Elvis, how, you, how are you doing? Are you guys from India or Pakistan? Bangladesh. 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 Well, there you go. Bangladesh, Elvis. <laughs> <laughs> Check my YouTube channel, MC Barber. Uh, MC Barber is also my Facebook, the MC Barber Instagram. Thanks for watching. Until next time, take care of yourself. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video uh, that I was done with MC Barber. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Till then, take care. Drive safe. <laughs>